We are applying uh, local anesthesia on the donor area. <coughs> From which we are going to take out the. We are giving one antibiotic, one painkiller, and one antacid to the patient, cleaning the area to give a test dose. The patient comes with a zero haircut. Now I am going to give tetanus topside, okay? Just as a prophylactic measure. I'm this is tetanus topside, okay? I am giving on the butt because this is a little bit viscous. So the patient feels pain. The staff is getting ready for the key procedure. Okay, sir. Come on, for the head bath. Making it zero, okay? In the area with all antiseptic solutions. We use a strip, seven arm, so I am cleaning with it. Yes, the time for local anesthesia, okay? I am starting, okay? Okay. Small pinch. I am bulging the area from where the graft to be extracted. Cleaning now. So the process will last for several hours. And these are exceptional, okay. It has five and six, okay, visible. And all these are multi-bulb follicles. Each follicle having more than... Uh, we are sorting out the uh, follicles which has one hair, two hair, three hair, four hair like that. The grafts collected, okay, after sorting has been placed. These are the grafts after extraction. Uh, the patient is enjoying music, okay, and just relax. He is awake, no pain. Patient is lying comfortably. The process is in full progress. Everybody is relaxed. So how you are feeling? Good? Okay, okay. Just show like this. Okay. Extraction has been completed and the patient will be given a brief break. Bandaging of the donor area. Now patient will be taking a leave. Thanks, sir. Okay. Feeling good? Good sir. What do you want to eat? Vegetarian or non-vegetarian? Vegetarian. What food? Vegetarian. Vegetarian. Vegetarian? Why not chicken? No? Weekly once a week. Weekly one time you take chicken? Sir. Yeah, today you can take it. This I am going to provide. Correcting the hairline. Making of a hairline is one of the important step of hair transplantation because the result, the outlook depends upon this one. You have to make it very cautiously and depending upon the patient's face, it should look good. So just I am making a, a hairline which I am going to correct in several ways. Whatever best suits the patient's face, I am going to the front line should be regularly regular to have a natural look. So this is irregularly regular and this area needs uh, the grafts. So we have just designed for implantation the way it is needed as per its facial architecture. Yes, sir. Yes. 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 The patient won't experience much pain after applying eyes here. Yeah, we are the only one who are using the implanters, okay, implanting pens. It brings the best result. The outcome will be very dense. So we follow the American procedure using the implanting pen. Though they are costly, 
but Dr. Fedos Khan doesn't care for it, okay? The patient is more relaxed in this position, in the supine position. He is conscious and listening to whatever we are talking. Implantation and we are covering the donor area with a neosporin ointment. Applying the bactigod, non adhesive gauze. We are applying the bandage in a way that after a couple of days there should be no swelling. Usually there will be swelling after the hair transplantation, but in this sort of bandaging, the swelling will be minimized. So just uh, we are following the same technique. So you are feeling good? Very good? Okay. Okay? Whenever. But don't take frequently. There should be a gap of six hours. 